Hey folks, Armin Hammer here, and today we're going to be talking about the West Coast Classic, a sanctional that was just announced this morning, taking place in Del Mar, California for the 2020 CrossFit Games. This morning, CrossFit announced the West Coast Classic is going to be added to the sanctionals list, and you can read that press release in the description below. And while we weren't surprised there was going to be an event taking place in Southern California, one of the things that we were kind of discussing is whether it was going to be taking place in Del Mar or possibly even in Carson. Well, now that question has been answered and we're gonna be seeing the West Coast Classic in Del Mar, California. While the press release is silent on the exact venue they're gonna be using, the West Coast Classic is in Del Mar and the Del Mar Fairgrounds were home to the California and the West Regionals from 2013 on. I've been to that venue a lot and I've gotta say the energy and the atmosphere there are seriously among the best in our space and it would be a huge mistake if they weren't gonna be using that. So my gut's telling me they're gonna be at the Del Mar Fairgrounds, which is gonna be awesome. The West Coast Classic is scheduled for March of 2020, qualifying for the 2020 CrossFit Games, and it is the 18th sanctional that's been announced. 15 of those sanctionals are gonna be qualifying for the 2019 CrossFit Games, and I would be very surprised if we saw any more 2019 CrossFit Games sanctioned events announced because the season needs to lock itself up very soon in order for us to have a good picture of exactly how things are going to turn out. The 2019 CrossFit Games season is going to be about change. It is this transition from the old style of the game season to the new style of the game season. And we really have no idea how it's going to go, but for sure it's going to be weird. But the Dubai CrossFit Championship is in less than a month, and that's super exciting because now we can actually see all of this stuff in practice and hopefully figure out if there are any gaping holes in our plan in order to fix them before they actually topple the whole thing. One more interesting tidbit about West Coast Classic is that it's been sanctioned to Loud and Live Sports, the same company that owns Wadapalooza. And it's not a surprise to me that we're seeing multiple sanctionals getting under one producer's umbrella because honestly, these are the same people that have proven that they can run and put on events like this. That said, I think we're gonna be seeing dozens of these sanctionals popping up over the next few years and there's a good chance that there are gonna be some big players who come in and run multiple sanctioned events under the same umbrella. And I think that's a good thing because it brings a little bit of cohesiveness between events that could very well just float off in the ether on their own and be separated from all the other sanctioned events. But for now, I'm pretty sure we're not gonna be seeing any more 2019 CrossFit Games sanctioned events announced. And while CrossFit hasn't officially said that they're gonna be locking the season in, I think it's safe to assume they're probably gonna be locking the season in because, man, it is going to be starting really soon with the Dubai CrossFit Championships in just a few weeks. Remember folks, there's a whole lot going on in our space and it's easy to miss some of the most interesting and exciting stories. That's what I'm here for and I'll see you guys next time.